Hi guys! A few weeks ago, Elle sent me a picture of this adorable market stand and asked if I could help her make it. So we got all the supplies and set out to build it in her playroom. And if you saw her episode this week, you know it turned out amazing and was a total smash with the kids. Today, I'm gonna show you step-by-step -step how easy it is to build your own. We're open for business! Here's what you'll need to get started. For five foot rods of three quarter inch PVC pipe, two elbow connectors, two T connectors, two 45 degree elbow connectors, a PVC pipe cutter, a hot glue gun, and about two yards of fabric. First, we're gonna measure the surface of our market stand table so we can determine the length of our crossbars. Then take that number, subtract four, and cut two pieces of PVC pipe to this length. We're gonna have to switch up pipe cutting, Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Work out. You're so good at it, you're so good at it. Next, determine how high you want your awning to be and cut two pieces of PVC pipe at this length. These are gonna be our awning's legs. Ours are 24 inches, but this will really depend on how tall your child is. Next, cut two three inch pieces of pipe that we'll use to connect the legs to the side. Now we're gonna attach these pieces together. Take one leg, connect it to your 45 inch joint, add in your three inch piece of pipe, and then finish it off with the T connector. Repeat the same thing for the other side, and then add your crossbar in the middle. That took Brooke all of five minutes. <laughs> and one very important note, make sure all of your connectors are smooth and not threaded on the inside. Now we're gonna make our sides. You'll determine the length by putting your base in its final position and then hold a PVC pipe up to the wall and take that measurement. I have the easy job. Ours came to 35 inches and this gave plenty of room for the kids to stand behind the counter. That's gonna be great. Add a 90 degree elbow connector on each end and then place your last crossbar in the middle. Now our frame is complete and it's time to add the fabric. It was really easy to attach. <laughs> this is only gonna take <laughs> It's never gonna stay out. It's just, it's we need glue, this stuff is slippery, okay. Using some fabric scissors, cut your material to the size of the frame, leaving three to four inches around all the edges. And then glue it directly onto the PVC pipe. Our awning is complete and now we're gonna attach it to the wall. We use these command hooks, which worked perfectly. I've linked them in the description below, and I love them because they don't require a nail or screw. Our awning is done, and we added a few extra details to finish it off, starting with a side panel that we cut from our original fabric, and then we added this cute trim by cutting triangles out of yellow fabric and attaching it to the inside with double stick tape. And finally, we finished it off with some fun accessories to make it look like a store. Baskets, food, a mini cash register, and even a sign. We did it! And ta-da, our market is ready and open for business. Elle's kids were so excited when they saw their new market stand, and I couldn't wait to take Lincoln and Calvin over to check it out. We're open for business. I really like your shop. You uh, got a donut. Oh, thank you. Do you want some milk? I'll have some milk as well. How much does this cost? $10. And the best part is, this is a project that'll grow with your children. The babies loved it as much as the big kids. Calvin, what do you want for the pizza? Yes, the pizza. I actually wanted to play too. Hi sir, what would you like to eat? Two boxes of corn for my dad. Okay. And I need to call someone. Hi dad, we're getting groceries for you, bye. And don't forget to check out Elle's video for additional tips and play ideas for the market. All right guys, we had so much fun building and playing with our market stand. I have a feeling one may be making its way to the Mayhan household very soon. Tell me in the comments below what you're doing to celebrate the holidays and we'll see you in the new year. Happy, happy holidays. Happy holidays. Bye guys. <laughs>